Hey guys, look what we have here. 1995 Mazda pickup. This is my latest project right here. You say, what's so special about this truck? You don't work on new stuff like this? You're a rat rotter, and that is all true. I work on the rusty, junky crap nobody else wants, but this is an exception right here. This here truck was my sister Bonnie's old truck. She bought this thing back in 1995, brand new, and this is the one and only new vehicle she ever bought. And uh, she passed away about four years ago. And this truck passed through the family. One of my ne my nephew got it. He drove it. It was his first truck. And then my niece got it. And it was her first vehicle. And then I bought it off my niece. And uh, I've decided that I'm going to fix this truck up and keep it and drive it. And somewhere down the line, I'm going to turn it into a rat rod. Not a rusty rat rod, but a clean one. But in the meantime, I'm going to clean it. Maybe do some painting eventually. Um, better wheels and tires, lower suspension, you know, whatever. But I'm going to clean it up, fix it up, give it a new life, and uh, that's what I'm going to do. Believe it or not, this, this truck has well over 200,000 miles on it. Um, still runs and drives really nice. I mean, it's a little dirty, it's a little beat up. Um, so i got to work my magic on it. But that's what I do. So I'm not going to restore it. I'm going to customize it because I don't restore vehicles. I customize them. And um, I just want to do a before and after video. I'll be doing videos here and there as I work on it. But um, I, got it I got it titled in my name. I'm working on getting insurance. I'm going to get plates on it. And this is going to be a secondary vehicle for me. And uh, my goal is was to save it, you know. And I know it runs and drives, yeah. But... When this truck dies, this truck would go to the junkyard because most people don't fix these up. And this thing has over 200,000 miles on it. So my goal is to save it and keep it in the family as long as I can. So we'll just take a quick tour of it. She's pretty damn dirty. But all in all, this is a pretty solid old truck. My sister lived in Illinois and bought this truck in 1995 and then later on in 95 or early 96 she moved down here to Florida and this truck's been down here forever. Now she did move away and go to Tennessee for about two years before she passed away. So it was in Tennessee for a couple years. But this truck is rust free. It does have some dents and dings, little, little minor dents and dings in it and stuff like that like any truck this old wood but all in all pretty good body interior eh, interior needs work interior is just dirty I don't know if you can see it in the camera but carpets are really dirty seats really dirty but all in all the seats not tore up it's very comfortable Carpet's really nasty. Dash looks pretty good. Door panel's pretty good. Um, bed's just got a little junk in it, but it's in good shape too. But all in all, it's a decent little truck. High mileage, but like I said, got the four-cylinder automatic in it over 200,000 miles on it and she still runs nice and drives nice brakes nice and just got to get it cleaned up because it really it's really dirty been sitting for a little while and it smells like a chain smoker's been in this smoking one after another for a year so I'm gonna have to do a little steam cleaning on this upholstery and the carpet and then just wipe everything down but I'm gonna get my pressure cleaner out today and pressure clean it the outside and I'll probably get my steam cleaner out later and I'll be uh, 
working on that interior but all in all gonna make me a, a decent little driver I'm gonna use it as a secondary vehicle take a little pressure off that work van right there and uh, as time goes on I plan on redoing it a few times until I get it the way I want it but for now it's just gonna be what I'm gonna call a mild custom everyday driver and uh, later on down the road when it finally does die then I'm gonna get pretty wild about it. I'm gonna take it apart and I'm gonna do something special with it but anyways that's it guys I just want to share that with you let you know hey here it is if my family and friends in Illinois who definitely know this truck this is where it's at and I just told you what I'm gonna do with it so all right take care guys I'll see you next time